everybody, welcome to Brick Vault. my name is Mike and today I have a very small Batman minifigures collection update for you. This is the book called Chaos in Gotham City and what makes it special is that it comes with this Tartan Batman exclusive minifig. So I'm really excited to get this fig added to our collection but uh, let's take a short look at what uh, this book is all about. Alright, I'm gonna take my care. So when I first saw the book I was expecting something different, but it just appears to be a play activity book for kids. That is just a comic with some uh, puzzles inside and is uh, appropriate for ages 7 plus. Um, inside there is nothing much going on, basically we have the minifig which will open in a second. Um, and the book consists of mostly small puzzles for kids uh, to solve, we have some mazes, we have some fine uh, things in a... Uh, uh, big picture things and mostly like find the differences but uh, what makes it special actually for me is something I found in the book um, that I will show you in a second there to just go through it. oh I think it was it was earlier right right it was earlier so take a look at that take a look at that it's it's something that caught my eye right off the bat and tell me what you see on this page Tell me what you see. That's right guys, can you see that the row of Batmans has something we have not seen before. Um, that is the uh, Leprechaun Batman, kind of an Irish outfit. And this one is kind of a Uncle Sam Batman. So I don't know, or is this a rumor for uh, upcoming Batman movie minifigs, Do we, are we getting more suits? I would be hyped. Those two guys look awesome. We got all of the different guys around here, the fairy Batmans, the collectibles. There is the, uh, the golden suit Batman from the Batcave set, the cave Batman, the Glamrock Batman. There is even the clown, Tears of uh, Clown Batman that's gonna come in a poly bag from Lego stores in February. But those two guys, those two guys are not have, haven't been released yet, so I hope that is um, those two guys. I hope that is not a that is not a joke or an Easter egg. I hope this is an Easter egg that we are getting those two guys somewhere in the future. That would be super exciting, uh, and basically that's the main thing that got me excited about this book, except for the minifig, of course. Uh, so yeah, I hope I'm right. I hope I am right about those two guys, Leprechaun and Uncle Sam Batman. That would be super sweet. Anyway, uh, one more look at the book. Nothing special here. Find your maze to the clay face. More clay face. Find uh, like hidden characters in the puddle of clay. Um, there is a Bane. We can see that that's gonna be the new um, Bane set that's gonna come out in summer. We're gonna report on that soon. Um, and basically that's it. That's a kid's fun book. Oh, one more, one more, one more. This guy. This is a Mr. Beach Buddy Batman. Same, kind of a speculation, but why, why not? Why don't get like kind of a this minifig with future polybag release? Yeah, so uh, there's a whole page actually saying why shouldn't Batman go on vacation? Um, so we have vacation Batman. We have, I know we have vacation Batman with the uh, rubber ducky in the collectible series. But this one would be pretty cool to go with that, right? So we have three speculations, guys, from this book. And history has told that many speculations were turned out to be true when we were um, thinking about the previous um, news and upcoming sets. So this came out to be true. Anyways, uh, I'm gonna just put my cam back and we're gonna open this minifig and add him real quick to the collection, all right? Swing. All right, so I'm gonna get this guy out of the box, so let's open him right now. And our Tartan Batman is out of his plastic box. And I have to say that first impression is really good, it is a very detailed minifig. You can see his great print for the torso, that is of course a Scottish outfit or a kilt. And it goes along through his belt right onto his legs. There is a small Batman symbol on his chest and a belt going along his body as well. 
you can of course see his muscles on the exposed skin. And moving on to the back, you can also see that it is fully printed. The legs are dual color, so you can see he has a brown boots. And basically everywhere you can see this Scottish square pattern. Tartan Batman comes with this sword. I'm not sure if that is a new mold, I think I've seen that in previous sets. The head has two expressions, I think those may be the same expressions that we've seen in one of the Batman movie sets previously. The brown cowl complements the head nicely, as in every Batman minifigure. And he of course comes with a brown cape. And thankfully this is a cloth cape, that is not one of those polyester capes, so this one looks and feels pretty good. And one fun fact about this minifig is that probably the Waynes family is of a Scottish descent. If I am wrong, please correct me, but I think that might be actually right. So there you go, Tartan Batman in this Highlander Scottish theme reminds me of course of the Braveheart movie. That would be even more obvious if they added those uh, blue colors to his face like Mel Gibson had in the movie. But I am not complaining here as this is another great addition to our ever-growing Batman collection. So be sure to check out the video on this entire collection on our channel. Anyway, I think it's time to put him uh, into our Batman collection, which is in the next room, and just follow me on that. Na 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 na. All right. So we have the, uh, as you can see, the entire collection of Batmans is right here, pretty much. We have. All the Batman's release, you can uh, you have seen them in the previous video on the 2017 collection update. And this guy is gonna be an addition, so we have the collectible Batman's at the very top. So I would say there is a small space here just to separate DC Batman's from any other Marvel character right here. So I would say this guy for now, I'm gonna put him as an exclusive somewhere uh, here somewhere here next to Bruce Wayne in white outfit so he's gonna stay here for now that's gonna be pretty good uh, we're gonna probably move things around soon um, but we're gonna be getting more um, those exclusive Batmans like the poly bag it's gonna be uh, given in the Lego stores for a uh, gift with purchase but for now he's pretty good here and the entire collection is constantly growing because right now we do have all of them um, and we are expanding all the time, so there is plenty of space left. I hope on this amazing, amazing display from Aero Studios. We got a video on that as well a few days ago, so check that out. And without too much more talking, thank you so much guys for watching. That is Tartan exclusive Batman from a book from Amazon. And with that in mind, thank you so much again. I'll see you again on Brick Vault. Original, original Batman. That's nice, I guess. Uh, I'm Desert Batman. Why do you have a sword? Check out my cool new belt. More concerned about the flamethrower. <laughs> I'm Pirate Batman. <laughs> this is getting kind of ridiculous. <laughs> I suppose that one sort of makes sense. Let's rage! Okay, this is starting to get out of hand. What is going on here? Okay, I spoke too soon. Oh, hey everybody.